Hi guys, um, so I just wanted to do a really quick 10 minute ish video on what I've been using um, since dyeing my hair blonde. I absolutely love my hair, like I cannot imagine going back to like dark brown hair now. So I've had this hair for maybe about a month or two, maybe coming up to two months and um, I found the products that work for me so I just wanted to do a quick video to see if I can help you. So starting with the shampoo and conditioner I've been using. I've been using a shampoo and conditioner by Osmo and it's called, um, well it's a no yellow shampoo for super light and grey and bleach tones and also the silverizing conditioner for blonde and grey tones and it looks like this I got this from Capital Hair and Beauty um, because I have a trade card but I will find a link I'm sure you can get it online where if you don't um, have a trade card that you can purchase these I really have used Osmo um, products before I use a blinding shine spray and I literally it's the one product that I will keep on purchasing I absolutely love it so when my hairdresser Kelly the only hairdresser that I trust with my hair um, recommended these then I was like straight on it and to be honest with you these are amazing like if you don't want that yellow copper tone in your hair that blonde hair can give um, especially my hair every time I dye it it always ends up going copper um, then these are the products to use literally as soon as I've used these products and I've dried my hair my hair just has this really nice silver tone to it it just look it looks so pretty and there's no yellow whatsoever so I would definitely recommend these the only thing I would say is maybe just use them once or twice a week maximum. Now since dyeing my hair blonde, it's dry. I won't lie to you, it's dry. Um, but although these are great for the colour protection, they can sometimes make the hair feel slightly dry, which is expected, you know, it's basically like a toner it's got chemicals in there to help the the color stay so it's not like it's going to be extra nourishing um, so I definitely say use this once or twice a week to keep the color and the tones nice and golden but even if you can't use that every day or every other day there's still hope Creighton's Sunshine Blonde this cost me, well, each of these were one pound each. One pound. Like, I got these from Tesco. And I know you're probably thinking like, oh, you know, one pound, it, it's not really going to do much for the hair. Um, it's basically crap. Well, actually, these work wonders. Um, so, the Sunshine Blonde Conditioner and Shampoo, these are actually extra moisturising. Um, they rehydrate, brighten and smooth. Enhances natural and colour treated for blondes. Enhances natural and colour treated blondes. Sorry. Um, and I would really, really recommend these. I mean, for £2, like literally you can't go wrong. I just bought them on the whim because I thought even if they're, if they're rubbish, I'll just like chuck them or something. Um, or I'll, I'll give them to someone, but no, they work great. I use these every other day because I try not to wash my hair every day. I use these every other day and I love it, I love this. So using this um, alongside my Osmo No Yellow Shampoo and Conditioner, it honestly, my colour has stayed. There's no orange coming out, no copper here. Um, the tones of my hair have stayed really nicely. So that's kind of like general upkeep and then I do hydrate my hair because like I said my hair is super super dry um, and it's more so dry now because I feel like you can see the ends more with blonde hair. Apart from like the general upkeep of shampoo and conditioner I do treat my hair with masks and oils. Um, since having blonde hair I feel like I can see my ends a lot more, my hair does feel thinner. Um, but I don't know if that's because we're coming towards winter now. So what I use is another product by Osmo. And it's the Violet Mask. Um, it looks really cool. It's literally purple. Um, and you put this on damp hair. So what I'll do is I'll just 
put my hair I'll like flick my hair over the bath dampen it towel dry it put this on leave it on for about 10 minutes um before I get into the shower and then I will wash it with shampoo and conditioner it will help the tones of your hair so sometimes I mix it up and I use this with my um Creighton's shampoo and conditioner because I, I want my hair to still feel soft so I'll use the hair mask which will help with the tones and then I'll use the sunshine blonde which will keep my hair nice and soft but also make sure that it's not going yellow basically um, so yeah that's definitely one that I recommend and by the way I will list these products and the prices and where I've got them from so don't worry about that I'll try and put it all together in a blog post too now something I've been using for years like regardless if my hair is coloured or not is this Indian hair oil and it's called Amla hair oil you can get this from any like of your local Indian shops I'm not too sure I don't think supermarkets do it I might be wrong I don't know but I just get this from my local Indian shop um I put this on my hair and I will literally go to sleep with it and in the morning I will shampoo um and condition my hair but if you use this literally I need to shampoo my hair twice because this oil is here to stay like literally it will you really need to get into your roots to get it out but it's definitely worth it because when I use this my hair just feels thicker smoother it looks so shiny and silky now apparently it darkens the hair with constant use but that's fine because I would rather have like darker blonde hair than like look like a Simpson so yeah I would definitely recommend this and then finally um i use the revlon professional unique one all in one lotus flower hair treatment so what i do with this is once i've shampooed and conditioned my hair or you know use my mask or whatever the case may be once i'm at the shower and i've towel dried my hair I will spray this all over my damp hair before brushing it because what I've noticed is when I'm brushing my hair um, when it's damp it, it literally through the ends it's really tough so I'll spray this all over and then I'll brush my hair and it completely detangles like my hair goes so smooth with this and it just feels a lot silkier um, rather than just brushing it when it's normally wet and then drying it also let me tell you what the 10 benefits are so repair for dry and damaged hair shine and frizz control heat protection silkiness and smoothness hair color protection uva and uvb just saying easier brushing easier brushing and ironing incredible detangling long lasting hairstyle split ends prevention and adds body like what more do you need it's got everything in one product um so this is really really good i'd recommend it even if you don't have blonde hair i'd recommend it it definitely definitely detangles and it just feels nice and smooth and it's got a nice um scent to it it comes in i think this does come in different scents i got lotus flower because i love lotus flowers but um yeah it comes in different scents but i would definitely recommend this as just a finisher so um that's my really quick video on the products that i use to look after my blonde hair hopefully it helps you or if there's any products that you use that you would recommend then definitely let me know bye